Okay. Then, then how how to set up this uh, new carpet, carpet or drive belt back to this uh, Toyota V V T I engine? And there is a very very good uh, hint to you how I how I how I set up this belt. There is a first step is that that you look at what is the most lowest disc in this motor. And here we have this motor disc what is in, in here in here this big disc in there what I am I am hitting now and this is the word the first area where you set up this carpet belt. And this uh, idea is that when when we have those uh, areas where is this uh, very hard friction and force like this alternator there are those holes and in that area you think that these holes in here they belongs in in these holes and in that way in this way and this is the right way don't set up this carpet belt in this way because then there is a indifference because th there is no any holes and here are in holes. The idea is that this belt goes directly in, in that way and also there is important thing that, that you set up these these holes where are in here one, two, three, four, five. In here is also those upper parts one, two, three, four, five. And uh, five those hills and and here are five five those holes and this means that you set up this belt directly in this way in here not in that way this is wrong and also this is wrong and and this is especially wrong if you set up this belt in this way and this means that these holes goes in just like this now they are right. I, I take that these holes goes to these hills what are in this this alternator disc and, and where else are those uh, similar hills there, there are in this this motor disc what is in here this is this uh, picture and also in in this uh, power steering steering disc what what picture what, what is located in just in there where is this I I hit this this is this is a power steering pump and there is also those uh, holes and, and and then those next second uh, disc this is water pump disc and then there is only one support support disc what is in here this one and there is no any those hills and in that area this disc belt only rolls without this uh, friction okay and how, how we how we start to tend this uh, drive belt and th there is uh, there is idea that you start in this lowest disc, what is in this motor disc, and you you set up this carpet carpet belt in 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 that direction like hook, and you firstly drop this belt in here down area in just like that and. Uh, then you only hook this the lowest disc in this way, and then you check that that there are those uh, those uh, this belt belt is uh, in in right place in here. It goes in there. And also, it there is good to keep this belt a little bit thick then in this way. But what I keep, 
and then we check this second place it is just in in there there is this place that that this belt goes to those uh, holes in there in in just in there okay now now it it cools and then we also check that that this belt is nicely also in there okay in, in here we can see that it is in there and then next step is that that we start to rotate this belt behind of this uh, disc and this is first disc and, and please keep this uh, this belt stick then in your hand hand and then there's this first disc and you take this your your free hand and this belt must goes in here and then you little bit rotate this this belt that it goes in here in that way that way and now, now it's in in there and then then you keep your hands in here and then we have this uh, next next part is this uh, this uh, power steering feel and and then we only we keep this belt in that direction and we remember to keep in in here and in same time I I keep this belt in in here and there is this that belt is in there and then I I I insert this belt down in that way and then I have to hook this power steering field too that I I move that in here and I keep my hands in here I keep this belt in here and then let's take let's take a little bit closer picture and there is this hook and then I I I use then I use my both hand that I I keep one hand is keeping that in here that 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 belt part in here and second is is taking in here my hand and it it I rotate this belt in in this way and now now it's in there now this belt is it's hooked in this uh, power steering wheel in 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 here in here and also also in this down down there is this disc and then then I need to che check in my my hand of this of this there I take my hand in here and I little bit set up this belt that it is in those those holes and then it little bit opens but I I take my hands and I I set up this in here very carefully and then I also check that this belt is in this back area this looks good and then I have this final part that I I need to hook this belt in behind of this alternator disc and I take this belt in here and I keep this rel really carefully in here and now, now this upper area is okay but I need to only set up this disc in in that that water pump area in here that I 
I move this belt in this way and now now this belt is almost ready and and if you have this air compressor air condition compressor in here you hook this uh, belt in same way also in this air comp compressor disc and then I need to set up this this uh, belt in this uh, head of this uh, alternator and as you can see this is not enough that and I need this uh, friends and I set up this friends in here again in, in that way and there is this friends it's, it's in just in there and there is this there is this there is this socket and then I pull that uh, that that socket in, in in that direction in this direction to the front area and then this uh, same time when I pull that this uh, belt comes closer to this this alternator. Now I pull that and, and, and then it is almost in there. This is wrong way. I pull again and, and then I need to say that, check that this belt is just in right place. And then I loosen I, I loosen my hand and belt is in there. And then we need to final check that that is this belt in in this disc in right place and then we this check this water pump this looks okay and how about then this motor motor disc it looks like in right place and how about then this uh, this power steering power steering Okay, and power steering is not not in right. It is in wrong place. Okay, and then we have to adjust. There is this. This is not in in this hole. Okay, and there is. If you look there, this belt is in wrong. And and when this happened, I only need need to take this 19 millimeter socket. And I, I set up, I set up this socket in here, and then I pull that, and at same time, I little bit adjust this belt in, in here, in here. Here down area. Let's look that how this how this works. Okay, now now there is I pull that and at the same time I I insert that in. Okay, now it's it's in well 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 installed. Okay, and this was the final part. That part, okay. And then we check that is this uh, belt enough thick, and there is a good trick that if you can rotate this something like uh, 90 degree in here, then this this belt is enough thick. This is good rule, and it it goes quite nicely. 90 degree. This is zero degree and. This direction is 90. I think this is this is now well installed.